Hello. Um, this is Miguel. This is just, I'm going to tell you one brief message or one brief question of something. I saw one of the videos of Jujiro Kaniyama about, you know, the, conf the, the rising sun flag getting the confederate flag treatment. Yeah, the rising sun flag getting the confederate flag treatment. When the team from Kawasaki Tao beat a Korean team for so on, 1-0, and he says that some that somebody uh, waving the rising sun flag. Yeah, the rising sun flag. Goodness, is this have be big news? And I saw your video. Yes. What the hell are we doing? It's like, hey. At least this is no. This is they're not waving in, in a baseball game or whatever they play, or at a football game. American football, that is, comes with somebody coming up after a team wins. They come up and wave the Confederate flag, and people get shocked. Oh. Bam! We don't need the Confederate flag. Don't wave the Confederate flag. Well, the, the the rising sun flag getting the Confederate flag treatment is such a ridiculous and bogus, you know, decision. Something so stupid that, to me, the same flag is used in the Japanese Navy the same flag used in the Japanese Navy wherever it is you see the rising sun flag is the Japanese Navy flag right so I'll put this imperial BS you know that all is about the imperial BS look what Japan has done bad shit in the past and and stuff no it is just a plain flag it is like Heresy, this reminds what what it is, land of the rising sun, right? Land of the rising sun. But, for example, put it in a bad way, I still like the, the rising sun flag. It looks cool, it's awesome. No matter what they say, no matter what people say, on what kind of situations is going on, but for a matter of fact, this is where I'm, I mean, going, going home on a bike. But this is where I'm saying, what, what I mean that where this goes, where this thing goes, is that after I, ha I have planned to do something about Tekashima, you know, I'm just saying Tekashima is one of the issues that I have seen going on and on and on and on and on and on with this Takashima and and those stupid videos of people dancing around joining I call it dope dope bandwagon those dope dope bandwagon idiots come down and dance they go in the US they have seen one going in Spain like joining the dope dope bandwagon yeah, I'm afraid that this dope, dope bandwagon is going to South America pretty soon. Before I end up this video, I mean, I'm going to do my part. Everything based on Takashima. That's just doing something for Japan. But you, Jujiro, you could do your part because there's another I have been to a disputed territory I never been to Takashima but I've been to another disputed territory San Andres so San, Dren San Andres Islands is another disputed territory it belongs to Colombia but in a way this w but let me tell you where this going the only thing that the first thing that I mentioned 
to you, you folks watching out there. This is to Jujiro Teniyama before I get my official Takashima video. That um, it happened in the 2012 Summer Olympics in London that Korea put us part for third place, waving a sign that says Dokdo belongs to Korea. Yay! They won third place. And like how many times? It's like I heard in your in your Takashima video, how many times Japan got jacked twice now. Japan got jacked twice by by the Koreans. South Korea. What is this, the worst thing that could happen? That we know. I, I hope it will never happen. We hope to God and not to die is a British Korea. And Japan getting screwed and hugged. Well, here you go for mentioning. I'm mentioning one thing that goes on if the when the dope dope bandwagon reaches South America. So find out about San Andres. I don't know about like checking out the Miss Universe passion. There is one mixed Miss Japan or two women that are like mix Miss Japan they're going to tell the truth about Takashima and they're gonna take the way where the dope dope bandwagon goes to Colombia all you gotta find out for this for this thing is you go do your part based on San Andres Jujiro Taniyama do a San Andres video Combining the Takashima thing and the dope dope bandwagon, you know that they go and dance and everything. And please check those dope dope Korea land videos, and you see all those dope go, dope go go dope dope Korea where they dance, and you find out that this is what is going to happen in Colombia. And also, they're going to do it in the in another territory or territorial disputed area about dope dope you know and just find out the San Andres make a San Andres G San Andres video to Jiro Taniyama and you go in there you do the San Andres part because of San Andres is Colombian territory but the fate in that is where Japan where Miss Japan goes and what Takashima still is in the line because Takashima belongs to Japan. I, that's all I know. It's so like you see me in in in, in Facebook. Yes, you, I I got it. You're right. I agree with this. I, I agree. We are in the same boat. Takashima belongs to Japan. So do your part about San Andres. And thanks for informing me about the rising sun flag getting the Confederate flag treatment. At a soccer game between a, the Kawasaki soccer team against the Suwon soccer team from Korea. Bye.